Today's hottest music, Hot 103, you're chilling with your boy Henry G on a Sunday afternoon, all your favorite Latin hip-hop and oldies, requests and dedications as well. It's going down in a major way, Bay Area Thiz Latin edition of the show. Who better to give us the temperature of the Bay Area and let us know what's going on than Thiz Latin CEO Gold Toes. Welcome to the show, thanks for joining me. What's up, Henry G, man? <laughs> Out here, man, in Houston, Texas. Putting a smash down for this black and brown fizz Latin. Just spreading my wings out here. You feel me? What's up with you, bro? Out here getting it in. You know how we do it. Let's talk first of all about the local connection this Latin has with the Las Cruces. Of course, with Wicked One at this Latin. Yeah, Wicked, Wicked One putting it down for Las Cruces, New Mexico. And he's the go-to guy for your whole region. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and right now, you know, Wicked, like, we talked today and I'm like, man, he got the influence and he has the... He has a want to make something happen. And at the end of the day, man, I'm trying to make successful entrepreneurs. People that want to be successful. People that want to learn the business and just don't know how to get in. Well, I'm the guy you want to talk to. You want to learn how to get in. You want to learn what to do and, 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 and how to go about it. I'm your guy. Now give us a story. Let us know how yourself and Wicked One got linked up. And also, Thiz Latin is expanding at a rapid rate. Tell us about the expansion and what you guys are hoping to accomplish with it. I'm going to tell you, Wicked One and me, you know, we hooked up to you, you, of course, you know what I'm saying, you brought him to the table, I listened to his music, I talked to him as an individual, and he seemed like somebody that wants something in life, he, he's not just here for a handout, and that's not what my company is about, we're not handing out, you know, we're giving out opportunity, and if you take that opportunity, I'm willing to help the one up to the, you know, to the fullest extent. You know what I mean? Right. And uh, that right there means a lot. Right? Just those words right there mean a lot. You know what I mean? I've been posting exclusive footage throughout the week. You and SPM from your Gold Toes at Large DVD. Tell us a little bit about SPM and what it was like to work with him. Back in back in 2000, uh, me and South Park Mexican, um, you know, we was all we was already good friends, and and, and you know, back, even before he blew up, he was trying to sign the Black and Brown. Remember him calling up my my my. Uh, my business line and then they saying a rap, but I, I just wasn't out there in Texas. And so it was a little bit of a different type of a feel for me. And when I came out here, you know, I seen how he was putting it down, man. He blew my mind because, I mean, he had thousands and thousands of Mexicans out there just listening to everything he said. You feel me? And I was just, it was an honor to see that type of that type of movement, man. He really had a movement, man. You know what I mean? And it, it was amazing and, and how everything happened for him. And, um, you know, we made our first album. Uh, my first song, actually, I ever rapped on was that Game Untold, when we walked we walk on toes. And, uh, you know, that came, that was magic. That's still a big hit down here in H-Town. You know what I mean? Okay. And, you know, later on, you know, Baby Bash is already out here. Right now, I manage Lucky Luciano, and I manage Juan Gotti out here in, in, in Houston. So anybody need anybody, anybody need any management for them? Get at me at goldtoes at yahoo.com. It's all good. Henry G here with you on a Sunday afternoon special guest, Gold Toes. Now we're about to get into the track you just talked about, Game Untold. Go ahead and give us a story behind it and introduce it. I mean, this, this is this is Game Untold, man. And, and wherever I walk, man, I turn I turn it to gold. You know, basically it's like like South Park said it best, Toes. He said, Toes, wherever you walk, you make money. You know what I'm saying? As long as I'm around, I'm, I'm making money. I'm, I'm generating revenue for everyone around me, you know, from our crew for the people I'm working with and that's how I get down and that's how he came up with those words for that song and uh, Happy P hit the beat with that and um, man uh, that, that song is a song to be remembered me, Graham, he and South Park Mexican three my boys South Park man I play for that man you know that's that's still my boy oh, I, I, I don't I don't never like I don't go into all the uh, all the propaganda about this situation. All I know is innocent. You know what I mean? Gold Toes, SPM, Mr. Key, Grim, Game Untold. Today's hottest music, Hot 103. Today's hottest music, Hot 103. This is on a Sunday afternoon special guest, Gold Toes at Thiz Latin. Now, the Bay Area obviously has a legendary underground hip-hop scene. Artists such as Mac Dre, Mac Maul, Keek the Sneak, E-40, Selly Cell, Yuck Mouth. But what is the biggest obstacle in being a Latin artist from the Bay? The biggest ob- obstacle, I would say, it's just, it's just really hard. I mean, it, it, it's hard for Latin rappers in general, but as far as from being the Bay Area, you know... It's like our our section is is a very small section, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, it, it's like you know when you go out to Texas and like and it's basically the population. The population is smaller than most places, but the flavor is off the chain. You feel me? Our flavor is unlike no other. You know, uh, I started Latin rap in Northern California, and and right now it's still growing. I mean, we got it all the way from Seattle, Idaho, 
Chicago, um, Denver, you know, of course, H Town. You know, it is, and we working our way down south, San Diego, you know, LA. But you know, in the West Coast, you know what I'm saying? It's kind of like you got to. It's, it's it's a little divided with the Latin rap. You feel me? Because the sections of Northern California and Southern California, you know, it's just it just doesn't mix. And that's something that I'm trying to break barriers. And doing that, you know what I'm saying? Now let everybody know how you're doing it out there in the Bay and some of the artists that you're working with with this Latin. With this Latin, um, well, we, well, this Latin, you know, we got Mr. T, Tito B, Lil Coner, you got Big Tone, you got, I mean, basically every Latin in the Bay, you know, Freddie Chinga, got my boy Tone Loke with the videos, Little Raider, Jimmy Roses, I don't know if you guys checked out Jimmy Roses, he's got a, a bunch of hot stuff out. You know, he was one of my hottest artists. And, it, and it's still one of my artists, hottest artists out there. You feel me? And um, so I just, a uh, napalm and eruption on the San Francisco video. They got their new music coming out. And it's, it's, it's basically almost all the Latin rappers in the Bay really follow up under that umbrella or associate themselves with it. We're about to get into the track by Napalm and Eruption that you're featured on in San Francisco. Go ahead and give us a story behind it. Introduce it. Well, this track right here is uh, in San Francisco. Uh, my my cousin Carlos Santana, that's my cousin. You know, that's the Black Magic Woman beat. We got that beat, and uh, you know, we made the the, the the anthem. And this came after you know uh, San Quinn and Boo Banger and Big Rich had did a, a San Francisco track, and I was like, man, I want to do a Latin version of San Francisco. So I accomplished that. You know, we did that song and. Man, it was magic that day. We the way we did that, that that you know we gorilla. Basically, we did a gorilla shoot that day. Start telling people to come out, and it was just it all came together. Man, that day was beautiful, and the way the video came out, it was right now. That you know that's napalm and eruption. There's Latin artist, very talented. They got another album out. Uh, if you look them up under napalm and eruption, they go off the chain, man. This is that single in San Francisco. You know what I'm saying? Napalm and Eruption featuring Gold Toes in San Francisco. Hot 103. Today's hottest music, Hot 103. Henry G here with you on a Sunday afternoon special guest, Thiz Latin CEO, Gold Toes. Now, Thiz Nation is something that Mac Dre created. You carried the torch through Thiz Latin. What were you hoping to accomplish, and what are the milestones that you guys have been able to achieve as a label thus far? The- well, I'm, I'm, I'm going to tell you right now. When I started Thiz Latin, that's my whole thing. If you was from the Bay Area as, as a small, short-term goal, you coming through Thiz Latin, you coming through my label. Some of the milestones, I mean... We did it. We got on bringing on. We I've, I've now entered our music in, in major motion pictures, like bringing on five, uh, La Michonne. You know what I'm saying? My boy Freddie Ching has got some of his music on there. Um, another thing, we had you know a few hits on the radio that was on regionally uh, from Latin rap artists like Jimmy Rose. We had Who Rock Party on KMEO. We developed and, and and created bridges with my boy Burner right now, who's like an all star in the nation from the Bay. This Latin had a lot to do with his career. You know what I'm saying? And showing people, um, he, he was never on this Latin, but he affiliated himself closely because he knew this was a label to be reckoned with. Now, as someone who's accomplished as much as you have, what do you want to say to all the listeners out here in Las Cruces going through their daily struggles and at the same time aspiring to reach their goals and their dreams? Stay, stay solid. Stay motivated. Don't ever give up. Anything you want to do in life, you can achieve. It's all in your mind. You know what I'm saying? Other than that, Las Cruces, I got major love for you, Wicked. You've been a very important person in my life. And you don't know him, get to know him. So have you, Henry. Now, what do you think the biggest misconception that people have about Bay Area Latin hip-hop or just Bay Area hip-hop in general is? I'll tell you like this, Bay Area Latin hip-hop, it ain't all about gang-banging, man. It's all about player-made, making money. You know what I mean? A lot of people, I think, they people think like, oh, this is like, uh, you know, it's all gang stuff, and it's not like that at all. You know, we really got good music and, and, and feel good music. You know, check out my boy Jimmy Rose's. If anybody, if anything, check out Jimmy Rose's music. That's one of my top right here, Tennis and Thiz Latin, man. Check him out. If you're feeling him, you'll, you'll go, go ahead and start looking around to the other Latins in Bay Area rap. Bay Area Latin rap, you feel me? Definitely. We're about to get into a Jimmy Rose's track. Before we do, though, I want to thank you for being a part of On a Sunday Afternoon with your boy Henry G right here on Hot 103. Any shout-outs, any last words for the listeners out here in the 575? I want to shout out to all the players out here in the game. Keep your head up, you know, and uh, keep on pushing, bro. You feel me? Give a big shout out to you, Henry G, you know what I'm saying, for uh, taking the time to interview me and, and putting me down out there in Las Cruces. And if I come to your city, man, 
Stay with me, man. We'll make some money. Trust me. That was Fizz Latin CEO Gold Toes holding it down from San Francisco to Houston. Here's an artist Gold Toes just talked about. This is Jimmy Rose's Out Here, Hot 103.